Hi everyone, now we will learn in Laravel how we can make layout with the help of components. See, in Laravel we have two ways to make a layout. First one uh, with the help of components that we will learn in this part. Second one with the help of template inheritance that we will learn in the next part. So in this part, first we will discuss what is layout, then we will make some pages uh, so that we can use the layout. Maybe we will make home page, about us page, login page and all. Then we will make a component for layout. We will write some code inside this component to make it a uh, layout. Then uh, we will test it like this layout is working fine with the multiple pages and we will discuss some important interview question also. This is the playlist for Laravel 11 tutorials and that will definitely help you out for Laravel job, project and interviews. You can access this playlist from description box of this part. So first let's move on to our first question. What is layout? See, layout is a template that help us to reuse code, reuse uh, UI part, reuse tile and JS and our project or maybe uh, some pages uh, look and feel also be similar. So let me give you example where we can use a template. So let's say we have some pages, maybe about page, then home page and uh, uh, then login page, right? So all of in these pages, we have the common header and common footer. So I am not using uh, so much CSS and designer things there but there you can see that this header part and this footer part is similar in the all of these pages right so first thing we can what we can do we can create this footer and uh, this header page with the each of the file and it will take lots of time and our code will be redundant and all so better is we can use layout so that header footer and common UI part we can keep in the layout and that we can reuse with the about home and login page. So how we can do that? Let me show you. So first I am going to on the terminal and I will create uh, two pages. So let me create a uh, view for home and about PHP artisan make view home. Then we can make one more uh, which is uh, about all right so now uh, let's move on one of the page maybe for the home page and let me just add some uh, simple HTML first and we can put the title maybe home page like this and uh, then maybe we can make a header also so let me just take a div there then ul li and it's inside this we can make a some link also maybe for home page let me add some more there about login and last one is contact and similarly let me create one footer also and inside this let me take pa p tag and we can see that footer part There I can put a class, maybe footer class there, right? And uh, inside this, let me take one more part there, and the class for this will be uh, main. And there I'll just put some dummy text, maybe home page heading. After that, let me create h3 page. And there we'll put a uh, subheading and uh, then we can create a p tag there maybe we can mention uh, dummy paragraph text for home page something like this right so now uh, let's go to the web.php to make a route for this and let's make a route. Route colon colon uh, view and then let's put the URL for home is maybe home only and then view for this. Yeah and now uh, your uh, PHP artisan server should be started. So let me just clean all of these pages first and let me visit their home page and now you can see that this is the 
you can see that header and footer is for footer we need to add some style so let me add some style there uh, maybe position is absolute then bottom is zero then position uh maybe background color we can add is sky blue after that width maybe we can add 100 percent and uh, after that we can add their uh, let's say padding is 10 pixel text align is center so this is fair enough right so that will be enough to just uh, show this is a footer and let me add their style also style tag and let's change this class dot footer and then there is a p tag so let me add this p tag yeah so this is fine so for example you need this same look and feel on the about page also so let me just pasting everything there and let's change the home page to the about only right and then about page heading subheading and about page now you can see that and we need to make a route for this so let me make route and now if i just open there this about page you can see that everything is same except this some text so here you can see that the most of code is actually getting repeated maybe this header tag footer tag and uh, this head tag also right so what is the better we can define all of these things in a one file and reuse it so how we can do that so again let me go to the terminal and uh, just make a component i'm making a component php artisan make component on com component name which is maybe let's say layout you can create this component name with the, some other name also that's also fine so after that what we can do uh just remove the code from the home page and now you will see on the ui okay let me start this php artisan server again and home page you will find this is the empty page and put all of this code inside our layout.blade.php like this still you will find there is nothing to display and now in the home page just use this layout so this you have to start whenever you are using the component it should be start with the x then your file name which is layout you can close it and then close this tag and now you will see that we have all of this page right so how this is coming this is coming from the layout page because we are using this layout there and similarly if i will just use copy this code and put in the about page you will find that everything we have in the about page also but now the content is static on the about and home page we have the home page content only so how we can make it dynamic then right so for that what you need to do uh inside there you have to define a slot see i already created a part for components like how we can use component what are the components why we use them what is slot and everything we are already created a part for this right and for that you can find that video in the playlist so let me just define a slot there then slot name maybe title close it then uh, there uh, what you can do you can close this x slot like this right so if i just refresh this uh, still there is a no impact at all but the thing is if i just put some content okay even even if you want you can use it in the one line and just put something inside this tags maybe home page and now this title can be used in the layout as a variable how so just you can use it anywhere so in the title tags i'm just using dollar title and now you'll see still uh, we have the home there because that's what we are passing so if i just put pass their home then you will see that we have home only there right so we are passing it dynamically and if you want to use it somewhere else also maybe just below to the uh, p tag again you want to use the title dollar 
title then you will find that this is also working there right so this is the one slot and how we can pass the uh, dynamic thing so let me define one more there and uh, its name is main page main area or main page whatever you want to say and inside this so let me remove this title let's put the main part and or you can just copy uh, all of these three tags right and paste inside the this main slot and now in the blade just use double curly braces and just to use main there dollar main so let me just cut it first um, for a moment and now you'll see you have nothing there and if i just paste it again you will see everything is there because there uh, in a home.blade.php we have this main slot right and now if you just copy this everything in the about page right this will also still work fine and still we will have the old home page things right but better is so let me show you one by one like how we can create the slot and everything again just use the slot name of slot and name will be let's say title and uh, then we can close it x slot and there we can see that about page right and similarly let's define one more which is uh, simply main and for main uh, let me copy the content from there so that we can just write it very quickly and save time and now just change about with the replace home with the about right and now you'll see we have the about page everything because now we are passing this title and everything dynamically in this page so this is how we can uh, uh, use the template so let me just create one more file php artisan make view login and now let's see how we can use it with the login so first in the web.php let me create a path for login uh, route for login and in the login file uh, to just be very quick i'm copying the content from about and pasting there and now i don't want to use this only these tags so i just want to make a form there so login form so just put there user login heading and uh, let me start this php artisan server and let me open their login right and then the next thing is inside this so let me put a input field placeholder we can add maybe let's say enter name or something then maybe we can use some br tags maybe you can also use style there i'm just using them to save time just use a password and after that again some br tag you even if you can close them properly because we have to just close them like this right then at last let's take button and put their login and now if you'll just come there we have this login form but uh, the header footer look and food feel and everything is same right and let me change this text also login page so this is how we can use the uh, layout and create it with the uh, component in next part we'll see how we can create this layout with the help of template inheritance if you have any question any query you can ask me in the comment section thank you so much for watching this part guys